So teams familiar with one another for sure. And a rematch of the third place game. Remember that one just a couple of weeks ago? Yeah. Mongolia preventing New Zealand from meddling. Mongolia earning bronze. So maybe a little bad blood between these two. The dominator. The dominator. Bumping, bruising, banging, scoring. 1-1. One, one. Nico McCullough, he's tricky with it. Left his feet. Gets it over to the dominator. He sets the screen. McIntosh will whip it back down low to Dom. Dom will miss the lay. And Obertal comes away with the rebound. Arian Ball swings it down to the bull. I'll just count that. He's back on his bull. Davasa Bull. Now can he defend McCullough? I don't like his chances. Looking to get to McCullough here. McCullough up. Lefty. Floaty's no good. McCullough will track down to Wilson. He's got to deal with the length of Anobatar. They fall asleep defensively and are made to pay for it. Tonge gets the bucket. And an offensive foul will get it back over. McIntosh to Tonge. Back over to McIntosh. McIntosh could be an X Factor. McIntosh sneaks in for the sneaky lay. And now McIntosh caught for the shove in the back. He'll substitute out as McCullough will come in for the Tall Blacks. Igbata. Hands it off to Arian Bolt. Arian Bolt. So New Zealand doing a good job defending the perimeter. They don't want uh, they don't want Mongolia to get a lot of looks from long range. But an unselfish team, Mongolia, will continue to take what the defense gives them. And if you're going to shut off the two-point arc, which they did not that time, they got the capability of scoring on the inside. So the Dom able to draw the foul. That's the matchup that they'd like to see. Kelvin Ponto with the with Iqbayar defending. McCullough, two up, two does not go down. Arian Buck gets it down. Now, the block work from Iqbatar. Too strong on the baby hook. Quick feed back down to the bull. A whistle on the inside. Batar and Nobatar, by the way, the leading score for this Mongolian team with 10 points. Davasambu right behind him with nine for New Zealand. Again, I mentioned McCullough's 14, Kelvin Poto, seven. McIntosh, just a little long. High rebound stays with Black. New Zealand, they'll feed it down low. Uh-oh, the dominator and the bull. I like that clash. Kelvin Poto, unrelenting pressure on the interior defense of Mongolia. He ain't seen a fight that he ain't willing to take part in. If I tell you that, that Kelvin Poto and a bear got in a fight, you better check on the bear. He's that vicious. Does not show the touch at the line. Inkba Atar, no! Kelman Poto. Over to McCullough. McCullough drops the shoulder. McCullough, no, not enough on the layup attempt. Got a whistle and a hold. Holds called on New Zealand. Third foul in there. Mongolia have five.
The Archer. Down to Davasambu. Davasambu, the ball, bully ball. Oh, great defense. McIntosh was looking for a whistle, but from my angle, it looked like it was good D. 3-3, media timeout, 6.51, officially left. Can Mongolia get a pulse, have some life in this tournament? New Zealand very much alive, and a win here would move them to 2-1. and one. As I mentioned, Latvia lead men's pool B at 2-0. But the picture for the semifinals will become clear and will be crystal clear at the end of the day. Only four teams in each gender's competition will advance. Eight teams will have that Olympic dream deferred. This will be New Zealand's only shot at it. Great defense there, McIntosh. McCullough, two on the way. No sub. McIntosh, Faker. Drives, kicks. McCullough, oh. He missed everything, thankfully for him. Tongay had his back with the offensive rebound. And a warning. Warning for White for misbehaving. Bad boys. <laughs> okay. Tonga, he gets it to go. Keep an eye on the foul situation for Mongolia as well. They got six of them. Arnbo a little frustrated even though uh -oh. Well, I, I thought that might draw a whistle, and that is not a smart play. Aryan Bolt drew a foul. He was frustrated still, slammed the ball on the ground. They had just been warned for behavior. And now we'll see if McCullough can make him pay. He does at the line. So Arya Bold and company looking to play with some cooler heads. They're going to get it to the ball, bull, but he traveled. I saw it from here on that hop step in the post. Six eighteen. Two-point lead for the Tall Blacks. Dom, Kelvin, Poto to the crib, but he, he's missed that lefty lay attempt several times. Now he's got to defend the Archer. Good luck with that. And he stepped across state lines on that hero step. You saw that? That was extensive. Oh, now he just got bullied. The principal can't even save him. Four, six. Down low, ink by Atar. Now it's his turn to play some bully ball with McIntosh, but he is stout. <laughs> He's able to draw the foul at least. That is the fifth on New Zealand. And Mongolia's leading scorer will step up to the line with a chance to pull his team within one. Ain't by Tar, no good. Hand off, screen. Kind of a pointless action there. Screen didn't work. McCullough, feel the breeze. So McCullough not having the best, a good shoot today. Hey, that's a road kill. That was Al McIntosh. <laughs> The bull treated him like a rodent. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, 
Roll yeah. back and toss for the chin. And he gets called for the foul because he, I think he reached around. Uh oh. Six five contest. All right, three. Shot clock's ready, game clock's ready. Okay, let's go. Davasambo spinning and losing the possession. Out of bounds. A lot of scrappy contests. The offense has not been free flowing. As you would expect, nice dish out. The dog over to McIntosh. He's still offline. They got it cleared at least for Mongolia. Chalum Batar, McIntosh. Not much he can do. Arno Batar, too tall, too strong. 6-6 six, six game. The archer, the rest in traffic, comes on the Six six stays. Tonga cannot recover the Wilson. Out it goes to Aryabo. Ikbaya, high arc. Caleb Olivier comes back to it. Mongolia will make him count. And able to get the finish. Seven six. So you'd like to see a little bit more off the ball movement for New Zealand. They're just letting the Dom go to work. And his work performance on that possession, not so good. Cross from Arian Ball. That would spit out. McIntosh. Been relatively quiet in this game. He's got to force it up. Did not get up in time. Shot clock violation. We are at 3.08. Both teams a little bit gassed. Come on, let's go. So I don't have to tell you, there won't be 21 points scored. Not in this one. Seven to six game. Just over three minutes to go. Both teams in the penalty situation defensively. Who's gonna execute? And who's gonna be who's gonna make their free throws? We're sure to see some. What an entry pass from the Archer. So the Archer not just accurate shooting, passing as well. And helps give Mongolia a now one point lead. And Tom skipping through the lane like Skip to Balu. Now the Bull. That, that won't work out. Nico McCullough, pull up. No. On your bone. A no baton. Rudge in the trouble. Got it back, though. 
the hook still does not fall. The Dom will take over the Wilson. He's got it clear. He's got a clear lane. He had one. It's three, one on three. One on three, he's got a shooter in McCullough. McCullough, he couldn't throw it in the ocean if he was in a boat right now. Drops it off to Tonga. And you see the way he things up. The ball is on the charge. He will miss the layup. Oh, no. And then an offensive foul. And Mongolia want to talk it over. Timeout. It has not been a pretty game. Not at A to B. It has been a tug of war. And right now at a deadlock. Mongolia fighting for their Olympic ticket lives in a must-win situation. Final game for each of these teams. Iqbatar, wait a minute. He traveled. McCullough setting up shop. McIntosh. Cross it over. McIntosh. Broke it up. Kevin Poulter has to try to beat the shot clock. He doesn't. He needs a substitution. Tongue will come in. The Dominator will get a breather. Here we go. To the elbow. Are you both? No. Oh, Tongue. Might have got away with one here. McIntosh will give up Tongue. Nice decision. To immediately attack the rim. That'll put him on the line. Two big free throws coming up for Aiden Tongue. Just 21 years old. Let's see how he handles the pressure under a minute to play. Oh, first of two. No. One more on the way. Free throw number two. Oh. Wait a minute, is there a lane violation? I believe there might have been. There was a lane violation on Mongolia, so Tonga will get one more crack at it. So he's gonna get another attempt. And he will connect on that one. New Zealand with the slimmest of advantages, not for long as Aoyifo answers right back. The Dom, can he knock down a two? No. Aoyifo, they got an advantage down low. Oh, the bull. Got deed up, the quickness of McCullough. Crafty defensive play. New Zealand. New Zealand want a timeout as we are knotted at nine. Take some noise. Hold on, let me hear you. It is anybody's game. Come on, y'all can be like that. Come on. Come on, let's see what the party out. Now, should we go to overtime? Hey, hey, 
Just to go to overtime, first team to score two. Uh, wins it. We got 29 seconds still left in this one. This may be decided in regulation. Maybe. Here we go. 23 ticks left in the contest. The Ducks to the cup. New Zealand. 10, Mongolia, 9. Now it's the Bulls turn to play fully ball. We're even. 10 apiece, 9 seconds to go. It's coming down to the wire. Wait a minute. Offensive foul call. New Zealand would have had a chance to win it. Now Mongolia will take over. Not an ten. Five seconds to shoot. They're gonna go to the archer. To Ingbatar. The tip is no good. It's overtime. Overtime. What that means is no time on the clock. First so, Again, it has been a touch and go, back and forth, tug of war between these two teams. Ten points to beat as we go to OTs and decide this one. So we will have a Maurice Lacroix buzzer beater one way or the other. Here we go, here we go, as New Zealand opens, Nico McCullough. McCullough, again, same result as he keeps coming up shorter than Lord Farquaad. Not nearly enough on his two-point attempts. Now it's up to Mongolia, will they go for two or one? We'll find out. Looks like they want to do damage on the inside. Ikbatar, too strong. He'll get it back. This time he tries again. Same result. Rebound to the tall black. McCullough. McCullough, stop and go. Lay is good. New Zealand need one. Mongolia should probably look for a two here. They do have a man named the Archer. The Archer. Oh, in and out. New Zealand needs just one. McCullough is dribbling. But I believe out of bounds still off of Mongolia. And went off the Bulls' hook. 4.2 seconds to shoot it. Tongue. Oh, put him in the blender, young fella. That's a deadly cocktail. Tongue, the 21 year old, delivers the Maurice Lacroix buzzer beater. As New Zealand defeat Mongolia. Mongolia suffer yet another overtime loss. First to Egypt. And now to New Zealand. Look at the beautiful pirouette from Tonga. A few looks at the Maurice Lacroix buzzer beater. AJ, nothing but a number getting down. Ain't nothing but a thing. I did Tonga. Hey, of course, bro. What's up? <laughs> the Tom. Coming, giving me a hard time.